then we have innings right innings has over oh man this is exactly our crick bus which we have built out exactly same man it has created a complete crick bus lld question solved it the exact crick bus the class diagram which we have built hello hey guys welcome to concept and coding and i think you already know that chat G gpt can solve any type of dsa question whether it's a medium hard anything but can chat gpt solve low level design questions so let's figure out and see what about the low level design like can we get some help from chat gpt or not okay so here it is so let me first just say hi okay hello how can i help you today okay let me check uh i want to test your lld or let me put full low level design capa capability and that's why i am here today okay let's see its response of course i would be happy to assist you with any question you have regarding low level design please go ahead and ask your question awesome <laughs> so let's see let's ask him a very first question because if you know that we have done the crick bus re recently low level design right on our channel so let's check uh, okay can you make a low level design of crick bus app what do you think will it be able to do it i think yes sure here is a basic low level design of crickbus app data storage the app need to store data about cricket team player matches score and other relevant information this data can be stored in relational database rdbms i don't think it's a low level design okay it's going to the db level okay uh, user authentication user should be able to log into the app with their email address okay match scheduling the app should be able to display the schedule of upcoming cricket okay i think it's more like a requirement clarification so match scheduling should be there live score updates yes the app should provide real time update yes it should provide uh, news and articles the app should feature articles and news about cricket matches yes user profile push notification the app should be able to send push notification to user yes okay so it's more like what crickbus should have so it just uh, listed those point but it didn't do the kind of what we were thinking coding and all okay let me put into some another way okay i understand the requirements okay i understand the requirement can you help me with the uml creation of crickbus app or i would say instead of uml shall i put class diagram that would be more appropriate class diagram creation class diagram of crickbus app let's see certainly here is a basic class diagram for the crickbus app okay user class representing a user of the app attribute okay it shows the attribute also attribute id mail email okay so it's kind of a, whenever a user comes to a crick bus so it have a mail id password and all then we have a match class yes we have created a match class which has teams relation uh, information about teams innings and all right so it also has teams playing venue venue date yes we have that then it, we have a team hey we have a team class also team has players so it has a roster of players you remember controller which we created it's a roster of players who will play who will not next play class player class so player class has name age hey everything we also create a person inside a player you remember like and the statistics for run wicket and more we created a scoreboard that is also same article notification feedback reminder class i think it didn't touch about uh, over balls innings but the top four 
four classes are very much similar to what we have. These classes represent the main components of the Crick process and the relationship. Okay, what about innings and over class? Are those not required? Let's see. What do you think? You are correct. The innings and over class are important for a cricket app like Crickbus. Here, how they can be incorporated into the class diagram. Inning class represent a sinning, uh, single innings in a class cricket match. Inning ID, team batting. Yes, team batting. Number of overs and so exactly same what we have. Over. Over will have a list of balls, right? Over ID. Over ID we have bowler who bowled it, run scored and wickets taken. Okay, these classes would have one to many relationship. Yes, innings has many overs. Okay, what about ball class? I think you missed it. You are correct. The ball class is also an important component of a cricket app like Crick Burst. Here, how it can be incorporated into the class diagram okay so ball class represent a single ball yes attributes might include who bowled it who delivered it who played it like all those things okay type of delivery correct run scored correct whether a wicket was taken or not a class would have one to many relationship with the over yes so I think with, with this, we have a very high level similar what we have built out, right? But this is awesome, man. Like uh, by giving some input, actually we have created all the classes, match class, team class, player class. And also in this, he created statistics, right? We have a scorecard and uh, similarly, he created roster of players, right? We have the controllers, player controller, batting controller and baller controller. So this is almost same. Then he has uh, after uh, he added innings over balls, right? So I think that's the very awesome thing. Like this is nice. So let me just ask, okay, some similar uh, simple question. Awesome. That's a good start. Now, can we make a UML of Crickbus? Uh, UML I mean to say that if you remember the boxes is a relationship has a relationship I am not sure whether it can create this uh, diagram wise or not oh man awesome oh man <laughs> it can do lot of things man. match match ID team venue date scores add innings yes we have innings right so we have a team team has players now it would create players right okay players so player has uh, i think player has person and all those things so player id name age position and stats which we have then we have innings right innings has over oh man this is exactly our crick bus which we have built out exactly same man it has created a complete Crickbus LLD question. Solved it. The exact Crickbus, the class diagram which we have built is same. Oh man, like same. Like match has innings, innings has players, innings has overs, overs has balls and balls generally update the stats with every balls and uh, match also has team team has players player has a stats so that's where the stats is team also i put the uh, controller of uh, this thing and the roster it already told about the roster awesome so this is amazing man like uh, if you see our crick bus which we have built out on uh, concept and coding the exact low level design crick bus has built it awesome like i'm amazed i didn't expect it <laughs> so 
let's see when like uh, what all it can do that uh, i am very much excited i am not uh, are you feeling excited or not i feel very excited okay let me ask awesome uh i have one more question for you sure i am here to help can you make class diagram for tick tac to game i think if we can do crick bus tick tac to game would be like for him for it it's like a nothing so game has board yes so it added a game display board okay so we have a player we need player so it has player 1 player 2 two players it's a game so that's why i put into a game two players player has name and symbol if you remember our tic tac toe which we have we have for each player which symbol it is playing with and the board awesome so tic tac toe is a very simple game and that's where is there the symbol example x and o which we have taken an enum if you remember hey man that's crazy that it solved tic tac toe also see implementation is not there but it has uh, written the class diagram let me ask thank you can you also write code for these classes nahi yaar ye to nahi kar payega like i am asking now too much sure i can wrote all these classes in python there is an example <laughs> oh man awesome man oh ho update cell and everything awesome man let me ask it can it code okay can you code for crick bus app which you provided me before will it yes i can write code for the crick bus app based on the class diagram i provided earlier yes actually it do store it here is an example in python can you please code for crick bus app in java yes i can write code for crick bus app in java oh team team has list of players and also the roster also like who will play next and all let's see okay that's uh, till now it's all good a player has a statistics also but uh, i think it's uh, runs and wickets okay this is how many runs a player has made how many wickets player has take very simple model uh, not like how many runs overs the complete details strike rate complete score card is not there so basic we are just making but it's good match team 1 team 2 okay overs he has put into the match itself not in innings but overs can differ like it's a t20 or uh, 50 over match so that's if you remember i have created a interface of match type we can have uh, one one day t20 or this one so a score runs wickets over so it is creating a score which is nothing but a kind of a score card for a player how many runs how many wickets he has taken how many overs a player has played so inning have batting team bowling team the exactly the same which we have created right so yeah innings has a list of overs Mm-hmm. so he, uh, so actually this is one good point so in the innings also it is uh, storing the score how much score this innings has made right earlier if you uh, think that we have to compute all these things from the team batting team how much runs they have made but we can always have a short form like where we put in a score for this this thing is good like this was missed yeah cool i think that's done but it is not complete where is overs are missing balls are missing certain things are missing but if you see that this is certain cool stuff man actually if we ask if we 
by itself it might give certain let's say 30 percent of information but if we ask correct question hey this is missing hey this is missing then if you see that it can provide more information and by working as a team members right it provided me something i asked like uh, hey this is missing can you also provide that information then it can well yeah yeah that is important and it provided more information so this is how if you see that the crickbulls the whole question has been done by chat gpt itself this is amazing man that's i am very much uh, impressed by the low level design capability and uh, yeah we have to i think we have to see we can use it more like uh, for different uh, difficult questions how help we can get right cool man that's uh, pretty much for today i wanted to see how chat gpt can uh, do lld questions but i also want you guys to see and experience it with me i hope you guys like it but i am very very excited as of now <laughs> okay cool thank you guys bye